Welcome back to Wolves Fan TV. Today is episode 11 of our predictions series, if you want to call it that. Um, have a look at the important games first for Tuesday, well last Tuesday, the 18th. Carlisle Stockport. I got Carlisle to win, as you would think. But no, Stockport have made it 2-2 and got them a vital point in the uh, playoff hopes. As Carlisle dropped down to fifth now, with Stockport going fourth, which is quite interesting. Kind of hampered them both, didn't it? Um, yeah, it's definitely hampered them both. They both wanted a win to stay in the top three, and um, so both of them dropped out, giving Steve Nibs a chance to uh, get back into third. Yeah, so that's it's good for Stevenage, but not for anybody else. <laughs> anyway, moving on to Mansfield Newport. Now, we all don't want Mansfield to win. We want them to stay out of the promotions <laughs> like I did. I've got Newport for a win, a 1-0 win. But Mansfield came through and won 2-1. So that puts them on the edge again. Yes. Teetering on the edge of uh, playoffs, but still quite far off. Level on points with uh, Salford um, in eighth at the moment, but they've got yeah. game in hand. Which gives them the advantage. And if they do win that... They're easily going above Salford and Carlisle, potentially. So it's all to play for in the playoffs. It's hotting it's up very... now. It's hotting up. Exciting exciting times. Yeah. Moving on to Sutton, Northampton. I thought Northampton were going to win that. But um, with the amount of injuries Northampton have got, they are severely depleted. Yeah. But they managed to get the result and keep themselves in second. Yeah. Two, um, but they've got some tough games to come up. I think uh, Northampton aren't safe yet. We know it all went wrong for them at the end of last season. Yeah. Um, Hopefully it'll happen they again. Could still, they could still slip out the top three. They very could. And then the last game of the important Tuesday fixtures, Swindon, Bradford. And I had Swindon for a win because I knew I, we don't like Andy Cook. <laughs> so, uh, Bradford, we're on an absolute great run. Win for Bradford would have put them in fourth. Right on the edge of um, the top three, but so that was a disappointing one for them. They're now five points off third. Yeah. Um, as we look to sack these games, Wimbledon, Swindon, um, got Swindon win, but uh, not sure about that one. But um, we'll see. Uh, yeah. Barrow, Carlisle, Carlisle absolutely have to win that. And um, Bradford, Gillingham, Gillingham form team at the moment. But Bradford, if they still want to hold on to any chance of a top three finish, they need to win that. Colchester Sutton, probably a draw. Col uh, Doncaster Newport, a uh, win for Doncaster. Hartlepool Crawley, um, we have Hartlepool to win that. But the way Crawley are going, I think Crawley will probably uh, I think it's get that. Definitely going to be tough. I mean, there's only three points in it, really. So if Hartlepool win that game there... Out of uh, relegation and Crawley. Crawley could be right back in it, couldn't they? Crawley might be stuck again. Uh, Harrogate, thanks to uh, their excellent win over... Some poor team. <laughs> uh, sorry for themselves, Warsaw. Uh, should have left, put themselves safe, I think. Uh, Latin Orient crew, that'd be a home win, I'd have thought. Mansfield Stevenage is the big one. It is indeed. I've gone for 3-2, to be honest, because I think it's going to be a very intense game. But I've gone... For Stevenage to win. Yeah, we've gone for Stevenage to win. And uh, we hope Stevenage to win because obviously we're not big on Mansfield. <laughs> Northampton, right. Harrogate. Uh, Northampton, Northampton need to win that if they're going to keep top three. Um, Stockport, Rochdale. Um, Stockport, Stockport yeah. will uh, have way too much, I think. But at the same time, I'd quite like to see Rochdale win. I think if Rochdale win that, it'll definitely put a spanner in the works for Stockport and maybe we'll see them next season, so... Next up, Tranmere Grimsby. That's uh, probably a home win. And then Warsaw Salford. We did have a home win for Warsaw, but the way Warsaw have been playing, and uh, with Salford in seventh, it'll really be a big dent in their playoff hopes if Warsaw beat them. Yes, but at the same time, we do have a manager boost. So we do have a manager boost. Ever so possible that we could. It's a change of manager, albeit caretaker manager. Um, Matt Sadler managing the Sadlers like it's perfect <laughs> Matt Brady and Evan <laughs> and, um, and you may have heard Warsaw have brought back one of their legends Richard O'Kelly used to play for Warsaw in the 80s a bit of a joker in his time but in recent times um, the main man being a coach helping Dean Smith at uh, Villa and Brentford 
and uh, he's come back to help Matt Sadler for the, end, for the rest of the season. So um, that's, that's interesting times. Yeah. Right then. So uh, what do you reckon? Are Stevenage going to keep that top three finish? Are they I don't think that so. top three finish. Um, Stockport, Carlisle, Bradford, all trying to get that third spot. It is very close. I mean, four, Stockport, I thought, four points off Stevenage, but Stevenage got a game in hand. So I think I think if Stevenage win their game in hand, that top three is pretty much settled, I reckon. But however, below Stockport, though, Carlisle, 72 points with Stockport, Bradford, 71 South of Mansfield, both 69. Yeah. So, I mean... And let's just any, look at... Any of those... Let's just have a look at the uh, the last few games. And what we've got coming up here. Let's have a look. Carlisle Salford. That's uh, men from the boys kind of uh, time there. Uh, Leighton Orient at home to Stockport. <sighs> Northampton, Bradford. Uh, there's some tough games coming up. There's some tough games coming up. And uh, one of the final games of the season um, that maybe will sort of have an effect is uh, Bradford Lake Orient. Yeah. And Barrow Stevenage, of course. Right then, I think we'll leave it there. I think we can. We'll be at Smashburgers on Saturday helping Warsaw can upset Salford and uh, get some pride back in the badge. Indeed. Thanks for watching. Wolfman TV, the joy Three. and the pain. Yes.